Hi, I'm Claire and I'm part of the sales team here at Don Amot Leisure Kingdom and I want to show you around the latest motorhome that's come up from Valet. It's a 2018 Eldis Accordo 105. So it's under six metres, short and compact, really, really specced well. So externally, you can see that it's on the Peugeot engine. It's got the Peugeot wheel trims. We have a battery locker here. I've got that many keys on this key ring. Inside there, you'll see the leisure battery, easy access. And here is where you'd plug your mains connection when on site. You post the wire through there so that you can lock it up and make sure everything's secure. This is the point where you fill the water. So when you get onto site, you take that off and then put the water in using a hose pipe. There's fridge vents here and below you will see that you've got your fresh water waste um, and this is the um, flue for the whale heating system. As we go down the motorhome, this is where the cassette toilet is stored and to the rear you can look up and see that it's got a reverse camera. On the roof it's got the TV aerial and it's also got a solar panel. So let's have a look down this side. So down this side if we look up you can see that it's got an awning that winds out and then above the door, or sorry, to the right of the door, is your awning light. This here is a storage that will take two gas bottles. So we'll take a closer look inside and see what it's got to offer. So here we are inside the Accordo 105. Um, as you can see on the door, we've got the fly screen and here we've got easy use control. So we've got the on and off, the lights, the awning light, the master switch, tank heater, water pump and water fill. Um, not water fill, water gauge to tell you how much water is in your water tank. This here <coughs> is the whale heating system, so you can heat your hot water using that button and heat the inside of the caravan using that button, either on gas or mains electricity. As you can see here, we've got two long bench seats. These make into your double bed, but they're really nice and comfortable for a relaxing afternoon. As we look around the corner, Wendy will show you where the designated TV bracket is. And there you've got a 12 volt socket, an aerial point and a main socket. So to the front of the vehicle, you can see we've got a six speed manual gearbox. We've got cab air conditioning, 12 volt USB, all the steering wheel controls of which you expect and the camera here for the reverse. As we look up, you can see that we've got the skylight this opens up and it's also got a blind on there um, so it makes everything nice and dark at night time along with the windscreen. So you've got blinds that meet in the middle on the windscreen and blinds on the door as well. There's no shortage of storage cupboards in here. Yep. The kitchen area is well equipped. We've got a microwave, we've got a good sized sink, we've got a fridge that works on gas and mains electricity, three gas burner hob and we've got a combi oven and grill. To the side, Wendy will show you the set of drawers that it has. Really nice, smart storage. And then we've got a tall but narrow wardrobe. Inside the wardrobe, you'll see the storage for the table. You can see the winder for the canopy. And you can also see the TV aerial point. The washroom is to the back of this motorhome. Really, really nice, smart washroom. So to the left, you can see that you've got the cassette toilet. Um, on the top of the toilet is your flush point um, and then obviously there's a blade on the toilet which empties the toilet as well. We have got a vanity cupboard and we've also got a towel rail here and we've even got a lube roll holder. That's posh. We are posh Wendy. <laughs> um, we have got here the vanity sink, um, hot and cold water um, and we've got a storage cupboard. Not forgetting the mirror and you've got me and Wendy. Mm -hmm. Clearly we don't come with this thing. <laughs> Inside here, we've got a really good size shower. Um, the shower head will come off, so you can use it if you've got little ones that want to sit in there and have a little bit of a splish splash. You've got the soap holder and the door concertinas across. Yeah. But it's a nice size shower. So, if I was you, I'd be jolly well thinking of getting over to Don Amot Leisure Kingdom as quick as you can and come in, taking a closer look at this Accordo 105 with just over 8,000 miles on the clock. Um, if you want to come at the weekend, come and see me. My name's Claire and I'll be here to help.